the DG prison told me that, you know, we have a unique problem and uh, we will have to conduct uh, prisoner eviction and uh, because they don't want to leave prison premises. And I was like, I spoke to 30,070 prisoners on record and I've never come across a single individual saying that they don't want to leave prison because the whole purpose is to go out of prison. So I was waiting in front of this, it was like a village. Uh, I was standing over there and I was waiting for the superintendent to take me to a prison. He just took me to this place and he disappeared uh, and he got busy getting me tea or, you know, like, so I told him that, you know, we've come over here. Can we, can we now visit the prison? I mean, it's getting late. I have work. I have to report to the court. And he was like, this is the prison. And I, I just, I was so baffled because there was no bar. There was no wall. There was no gate. There was no guard, no uniform men. And I, I just, I couldn't believe that that was a prison. It, it took me some time to uh, like process that, that this is a village, but this is also a prison. So it was fascinating. And when I saw that, I was thinking that if this is, if this has been there for the last 70 years, why not? I mean, this can be spread across the country. So, and it's a successful model. It has stood the test of time. And it's, uh, it's a humane alternative to the closed prison system.